Hey, I'm Jake. And I'm Christine. And today we're going to look at the trailer for a slasher film with what is considered to be one of the most shocking endings in horror history. We're obviously not going to get into it today, but that should be a bit of an incentive to at least check out the trailer before you see the movie. I'm curious. Dear Mom and Dad, I've been at sleepaway camp for almost three weeks. And I'm getting very scared. Welcome to sleepaway camp. Someone is watching you. Hey, Mother, revolve! Bill, we're getting back to um, traditional format, mm -hmm. trailers that do not give away the story. Yep. And this is also, again, one of the shorter trailers, mm -hmm. but at the same time it shows, like I said, doesn't give away the plot, but shows just enough to make you wonder, what is going on? Yeah. And didn't even show anything graphic, but no. you could see, I could see you flinching a little. Yeah, because you're like, okay, I know something's going on, but like, they edited well. Let me just put it this way. The death scenes in this movie include, without spoiling anything, boiling water. Saw that one. Bees. Ugh. And a curling iron. Oh god. <laughs> I'm gonna leave it up to your imagination, just how those things are used to kill somebody. I don't like that thought. <laughs> Yeah, Sleepaway Camp, it's uh, one of the most infamous slasher films and is a big favorite amongst the horror community. Mm -hmm. And definitely, if you're lucky enough not to know the twist ending, and it's the internet age, it's almost impossible to keep anything not spoiled. But even if you know the twist, um, the ending is pretty interesting to watch. Without giving anything away, it's about two kids who go to summer camp, and there's a killer around, and people suspect the killer is either the boy or the girl. And it's not revealed to the end, but at the end, you get something you just didn't see coming. Huh. I'm curious. I like the emotion that the you see from the actors in this trailer. Mm -hmm. It's everybody looking so freaked out. Yeah, and, and they, they look genuine. Yeah, like that girl at the end is like, oh my god. Just... Wow, she was really giving it her all. And, fun fact, just because it's fun and kind of touching, the director dedicated this movie to his mother. Oh. Um, I don't know what I want to be. Okay. I don't know about you, but if I ever make a feature length film, I'm not dedicating it to my mother. Just because I'm not sure she would want the type of stories I have in my head to be dedicated in her name. <laughs> so, uh, I would definitely recommend this and hope you get to it someday. I, mean, I do like camps. And horror. Camp and horror. Yeah. Check it out. <laughs>